Dr. Amoso. Today, I want to present uh, on the evolution uh, of a man. Evolution, uh, we are talking about the changing of men. Men yet to change, men yet to evolve. So that evolving now, it's uh, what led the man eventually to become what he is as the homo sapien sapien. So today we want to talk about these developments that took place uh, uh, from at the beginning when this man was uh, changing. So we are going to start by Rama Akasa. Rama, he was the first man. It is said that Rama Akasa lived nine million years ago. He lived long ago. So there were fossils that were discovered in India and also at East Africa. These are fossils that they were attributed to Rama Apithecus. It is said uh, that Rama Apithecus was hairy and he walked like a gorilla or a chimpanzee. So he was walking like a gorilla and also a chimpanzee. You know when a chimpanzee and a gorilla are walking. And it is said that he had a small and a large what, amolas. These amolas, they were what, a large. And it is said that he ate uh, hard nuts and seeds like what the modern man does. And it is said that Rama Pithekas, he is the ancestor of a modern what, uh, uh, what, uh, human beings. So Rama Pithekas, he is the ancestor of uh, a modern what, uh, humans. So this is the first man who developed, who was known as Rama Pithekas. Then we see uh, that as time moved on, he developed to a Homo erectus. Homo erectus was discovered in a Tanzania and old by God. In Tanzania, old by God. He was discovered uh, in 1924 by Professor Raymond Adat. And when Raymond Adat discovered uh, this uh, Homo erectus, he discovered this cow, this cow uh, that uh, was appearing as if it was uh, that of a man and also an ape. So that cow, it appeared as that of a man and also uh, an uh, ape. And the term Homo erectus, it is derived in two words. These words are homo. Homo, it means human being. It means a man. Erectus means a to uh, what walk upright. So he has now the ability to walk upright. You know, they were walking through the what a four legs and twin, 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 twin. But now, as a homo erectus now, he was now using the two legs now to what a uh, to uh, walk. Then the two legs now, they were up, they were now used as what is a hand. During this particular period of time, Homo erectus was hairy. Eh? He was walking like an animal, but now the two uh, legs were now used as hands, and the other two legs, they were now used as what is what a for uh, uh, walking Homo erectus. He now also started to use a fire, and he was now in a position of uh, cooking a food. So cooking food meant that the jaws were uh, being uh, reduced. So as they were reduced now, and we see uh, that he was slowly developing uh, to become a, a man. So these are the characteristics that we have uh, on Ramapithecus, our modern ancestor, and also our homo erectus. Uh, thank you so much, I'm Dr. Moussa.